Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So the number one question that I get asked about cameras and photography is what's the best camera for me to buy? And in short answer, it's basically just the camera you can afford at the time. I just wanted to put like, do a little test for you guys just to prove that you don't necessarily need the world's most expensive camera to go and take an amazing photo. Photography is subjective, so you don't necessarily need the highest pixel rate or the fastest frame rate. You just need a camera that you understand, you can work well and tell a story with. So today I've put together a little experiment. Um, I'm getting my friend in, Ed, who's... He's not a complete amateur, he knows his way around a camera. He's gonna play around with my professional camera and then I'm gonna play around with a more so amateur camera, something that you buy if you're gonna go on a holiday. And I just wanted to prove to you guys that you can have any camera you want and still take a great image. So you'll notice in this little experiment today that most of the photos that I take and also Ed takes, there's always some sort of like a story behind it. It's telling a bigger picture, especially with the action sports one. I, I always tend to find movement within an image to, to create that, that form of action and make it more impactful. And then for, for the portrait, it's, there's always that sense of telling a story as well and finding nice lighting. So there's a lot of elements that come into play in photography. And I just wanted to prove to you guys that, you, you know, the camera that you got right now is perfect. And if you wanted to upgrade, then just go within your budget, you know? Don't think that you need to have to spend a huge amount of money on an epic camera. The camera you got right now probably does the job perfectly. So, let's get into the episode. Okay, so we're on location with Ed. Hi. Ed is amateur for today. Amateur photographer. Yeah, amateur Video photographer. Video. All things amateur. <laughs> you get to shoot on the 1DX today. This is my baby, so look after her. So I'll give that one to you. Do you know how to use a camera? Well, click this button, you turn it on first, and then see how it goes. Excellent, <laughs> excellent. And today I'm gonna to be shooting on this little camera here, it's a G7X. This is about $800 AU, maybe 700, and that would be close to around $10,000. So, professional camera, amateur point and shoot. We're gonna go through three different categories. Action, sport one, then we're gonna go through a portrait session, and then we're gonna use the boards and just get some product shots. And we're just gonna test out to see whether you need an epic DSLR if you're an amateur, or if you can just get epic photos still on an amateur camera. So let's get into it. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. I was gonna do a scissors, paper, rock to see you guys first, but I just figured I'll let you go first, seeing as you're the novice. So All you don't right. get any ideas from me. So we're gonna start with the action sport first. We've got the booster board ready to go. And I've got my pose ready to go. That is true photographer pose right there. Got it. So Ed, I'll get you to uh, direct me, I guess. So I want you to get used to the board, feel comfortable on it, because then uh, the more comfortable you feel on the board, the better the shot I'm gonna get. All right. Um, so I'm just gonna uh, various spots and see where we go. Uh, have I got the right remote right now? No. Yeah, you have, but I put it on the lowest setting. How's that work? Good. <laughs> Is the board on? Ah, the board wasn't on properly. All right, ready? All right, just be careful. You gotta look cooler. If I'm gonna get a really cool shot of you, I need you to look cooler. Ah, we're gonna go again. Hey, we're gonna try and line you up between these lines. Yeah, that works. So if you cut that four by five, it should look pretty good. I mean, if this isn't composition, I don't know what is. <laughs> Use me a leg to add a bit of depth to it. Come on. Uh, mate, can, can you teach that? I've got an idea. All right, we'll try that one again, please. Again, I f***ed it up. Why was that not tracking? Focus? No. Change the setting. Yeah. Go to you the... can't help you. Yeah, you're not allowed to help me. You're gonna have to Surely you can't help you. It's about understanding the camera, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it is about knowing your camera. You know what? You just keep trying. You know what? We're gonna work it out. A few moments later. What's your shutter speed at? As I come in, you wanna focus on me to go to the Q button here. So what he's done here is he's given me his 1DX. He's put the settings in the most expert mode that even a very experienced photographer like himself struggles to do. I mean, you can cut this out of the blog, but. 
probably will. Point proven. So we just switched up the settings um, to allow for tracking focus. Thanks, let's go again. We got it. Got it? We got it. Go, come down here. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> Going for the minimalist approach. I don't know how much action's in this photo. There's not much action, but it's gonna look good. I mean it's it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> It's not the best in the world, but that's probably because you're not Tony Hawk. How'd you go? Um, challenging, actually, yeah. to be brutally honest. There's a lot of options. It is very difficult for me to get my head around everything that's going on. It's been a challenge, but it's been fun. And I've learned a few things. You've got more, more learning to go, man. <laughs> <laughs> Should we swap over and I'll get the little camera out? And yeah, let's play? do it. All right, so I've got my weapon of choice. G7X. How do I put it on burst mode? Oh, here we go. Continuous. Let's see how quick this is. Get ready, listen in for this bad boy. Hey, that's not bad. That's good. So I'm gonna get you to like yep. skate down this second one down. A little bit different to what we were doing before. Nah, it's not tight enough. It's not quite right. Hang on a sec. Can't really see him. Can you come back up to this level again? He's a bit too far away. I had this idea in my head that I think it's gonna work, but. Cause he's wearing black, he's, he's too dark. You can't really see him in the shadows. We'll just move on. You're better off to move on than just keep hustling and grinding at the same shot. It's not working. It's got this sticks platform. Oh. You stay in the middle, yeah. That held up all right that time because... I could do a kickflip up there. I doubt that. Let's go, let's go over here. It's very dark, but I reckon we can make it work. <laughs> it's just like a silhouette of you. Yeah, that's one. That'll be sick. Yeah, it was okay. Okay is not good enough. Can you go through the water again? That's pretty good, go deeper in the water this time. Make it look like you're turning real hard. Can you go, can you go in the water earlier? Yeah. That's the one. We got it, I'm happy with that one. The water's going everywhere. It's a bit of action, a bit of movement. Could work nicely. All right, I reckon we move on. All right, what's next? Portraits? Portrait. First one I want to get is the classic. It's just standing here. How do you want me like, to pose? I just want you to be happy. Be happy, okay. Yeah. I'll do the old um, giant told the funny joke off to the side. Oh, giant, that's actually hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> What's your focal length? Uh, my focal length is eight. <laughs> <laughs> what? <That's> the... <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> I knew he wasn't going to get that right. <laughs> That's aperture, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. That's why I'm the amateur photographer today. I want you walking up the steps. Do your hair a bit. Re readjust your hat, please. Getting judged. <laughs> Yeah, cool, I'm done with that one. <laughs> All right. A bit further back. Oh, why is that fixing that? All right, I want a star jump, please. Star jump? Yeah. Really? Yeah, go. <laughs> I feel like I look like a complete fool. I think it looks pretty cool if you ask me. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, it's not a, por I mean, it's it's not a portrait yeah, yeah. shot. It's probably not a portrait, but like, well, I accepted that, so we'll accept it. <laughs> so, one thing we haven't done correctly is wear contrasting colors. All <laughs> black is generally not good for <laughs> photography. Um, all right, I want you to stand up against this wall. 
just want you to gaze out into the light. This is all those Insta-famous shots that you see, except they're usually captured by professional photographers. Can I just say, this, I've never posted a photo like this before in my life. Yeah. Cool. Crap's down right here. Do you want me looking up? Oh, we need to change this. Oh, <laughs> so we've just come from a really dark place to a, um, a really light place, which means I've got to play with the ISO and the shuttle speed. That work. All right, let's go swap the cameras over. You'll notice that at the request of my uh, wardrobe manager, I've been asked to put the hoodie back. Yeah, look, on. I didn't like the t-shirt. I like the hoodie better. We're in a very dark space, so the idea is to find as much soft light as possible. And right now we've got like a nice like window light coming in from side on its face. And then a bit of dark, dark shadow on this side. Come forward a bit. Hold the great, like looking directly down the barrel of the lens. Oh, like so that. like kind of cash. Yeah, yeah, like cash. Oh. cash. Yeah, that's it. That just sort of like. Like jump off like that, like you can get your body out sideways and up, yeah? Yeah. So like I want you to go like, like that. Can you do that? He's asking me to utilize my core. Oh my god, look how dirty that is. Uh, are you sure you want yeah, me to do that? Yeah, you can do that. You're joking. Two, one, go. It's a bit dark because everything's so black. Can you get your, one of your skateboards out of the car? We use a prop. Yeah. Oh, there's lines in there. Look at this. Those are right, eh? Charlie vibes. So we're going to do some product shots with the two cameras. Because Ed's gone first the first couple of times, um, I'm going to mix it up and go first this time. Move on quickly. Oh, this screen comes in handy at least. Ooh, that tied up in that girl. getting some uh, nice tight ones here. All right, so I'm finished now. We're switching over the cameras again. I don't want you sitting here. We feet are on the board, both feet. Between these two white dots, the logo to sit. Yeah, cool. Got it? Yeah, I did. Got it. No, that was good, that was perfect. Just put it on its own, a past the key clear. I think that could work. I can run with that. Done? I think we're done. I think the next thing we do is just get on the boards, have a little skate around and go get something to eat. What do you reckon? Get on a cruise. Let's do it. Sounds good. Let's go. Slaving for days, just give me one shot. 